Hello everybody. Have you ever heard of a place called Wales? It's a beautiful part of the United Kingdom, full of amazing stories and landscapes. Are you ready to explore? Let's dive in. Wales is like a hidden gem on a treasure map. It's located to the west of England. Imagine it as the smaller sibling in the big UK family, but with a huge heart. Have you seen those lovely green hills in pictures? That's Wales. It's got mountains, valleys, and a long coastline. There's a big mountain called Snowdon. It's the tallest in Wales. Some brave people even climb to the top. Now, think of a dragon. Yes, a fire-breathing dragon. The dragon is a big symbol for Wales. If you see a red dragon on a flag, that's the Welsh flag. Pretty cool, right? Wales has its own language too. It's called Welsh. While everyone speaks English, some also speak Welsh. It's an old language with a wonderful sound. In Wales, you will see signs in both English and Welsh. It's like a secret code. Wales loves its music and stories. There's a big event called the Eisteddfod. It's a festival where people dance, sing and tell stories. They wear special clothes and there are lots of prizes. It's like a big party celebrating Welsh culture. Do you like castles? Wales is like a fairy tale when it comes to them. There are many castles. Some are old ruins and some are still standing strong. People from all over visit these castles to learn about the old kings and queens. Oh, and don't forget about the sheep. Wales has lots of them. In fact, there are more sheep than people. They roam the green fields and some say they're the true rulers of Wales. <laughs> I'm only kidding. Now, food. Wales has some yummy dishes. Ever heard of Welsh cakes? They're like sweet pancakes with raisins. There's also cool, a warm soup perfect for cold days. And if you visit, you must try rarebit. It's melted cheese on toast. Simple, but oh so tasty. Wales is also famous for its coastline. It has lovely beaches where you can play in the sand and some are great for surfing. Imagine riding the waves with the beautiful cliffs in the background. But Wales isn't just about nature and history. It has modern cities too. Cardiff is the capital. It's a lively city with shops, museums and even a big castle right in the middle. Think of it as the heart of Wales, beating with energy and fun. People in Wales are friendly. They love to chat and share stories. If you visit, they might sing a song or tell you about a legend. Maybe about King Arthur, who some say was from Wales. But remember, every place has its rainy days. Wales can be wet sometimes. So if you visit, bring an umbrella. But don't worry, even the rain can't hide the beauty of Wales. So, the next time you think of the UK, remember the small but mighty Wales. With its dragons, castles, songs and sheep, it's a place full of wonder. Do you want to practice your English with me? Join my free English learning group on Telegram today. You can also listen to my daily podcast on Telegram for just $1 per month. And if you visit my website, you can book private English lessons with me and you can download my audiobook. All the links are in the description. Thanks for watching.